morning and happy Tuesday, T-Birds. Welcome to The Nest, news and events for students and teachers. I'm Bennett. And I'm Jack. We're coming to you live on Channel One. It's here, the second issue of the Colas. Shorewood Student Produced Newspaper is out today. There are newsstands all around the school. The paper is completely free. Make sure you get them before they're gone. Does your family need a little help with holiday food and gifts over winter break? Register now for Holiday Baskets Food, Toys, and Teen Gifts. Families can register online at shorelinepta.org and click on Holiday Baskets, or you can pick up a registration form in the counseling office. Please see a family advocate for more information. Start getting ready for our annual food drive. It will officially start on December 3rd and end on December 14th. Donations will be collected through SAS classes, and please consider supporting this important drive. All donations will be presented to over 500 local shoreline and Lake Forest Park families. Volunteers are also needed to collect donations at our local, local grocery stores. Look for a link to sign up for a shift or two. And now we'll throw it to the video bulletins. Gee, I wish I had something to read. Boy, do we have news for you. Ever since the recession hit, our minimum wage jobs aren't enough to pay for papers. It's free! I can't take time out of my busy work day to run across town and get a paper. They're right here! Whoa! Okay. Whoa. And here! You already know. And here! No papers? I'm Bryce and approve this message. The coolest comes out on November 20th. Get yours now. Wow. You guys really didn't learn. Now I gotta take the stairs. Thanks. All around me are familiar faces. All faces. Worn out faces. Hey dude, what happened? I fell down the stairs because the elevator was full. And now I'm gonna be late to class. Thanks for the help. Well, time to do this again. Wow! And now we're back. There is no more news. And now it's time for our random fact of the day. Sure, what did you know? Studies show that putting studies show at the start of sentences makes them sound more convincing. Wow, that's very interesting. And on that note, Shorewood, thank you for tuning in for this edition of The Nest. I'm Jack. And I'm Bennett. And we'll see you next time on Channel One. Have a terrific Tuesday. Thunder. 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 Thunder.